There's one under the sink in here. What's wrong, Brennan? Nothing, sweetie. I'm tired. Danielle said you're mad at me for talking to Portia. Who? Danielle said you're mad at me for talking to Portia. No. What are you mad at me for? I don't want to talk about it. Go to bed. We'll have another day. I don't want to get in arguments in here. We already, we already discussed this before. I didn't do anything. Well, then, yeah, then obviously there's no reason for me to be upset with you, so... I'm, I just want to go to sleep. I just want to go to bed. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna talk to you about why, what bothers me because you don't care. So it's it's a lost cause. Are you gonna stay up here? You can go down there. What do you want me to do? I, whatever you want to do. I don't run your life. I don't control you. So. Whatever you want to do. You want to go hang out with her downstairs and go out there and hang out with them. That's what you were doing to me last night for no reason. You mean when you were asleep and there's uh, all the people that are fucking plotting against us in this game downstairs? So then why are you going to sleep right now? Because I'm, I'm just over being down there. I thought we said we were going to have fun. Yeah, well, you know what? There's some things that aren't fun for me. It's not fun for me to watch my fiancé get drunk and act obnoxious all night. What did I do that was obnoxious? First of all, you drink half a bottle of wine and you're hiding beers in the fridge. I didn't hide a single beer in the fridge. Really? I swear in my life... I did not hide a single beer. Okay, Porsche hid beers? Yes. Okay. Not for me. I didn't ask her to. Well, the thing is, Rachel is... I don't mind. I, I mean, for me, it's cool. that you Like, if you're going to drink and have fun, that's fine. But when you start getting drunk and, and... I'm not drunk, Brendan. I just... I don't know. I'm just wondering if I made a mistake coming here. Coming back. I want to. I, I, I want to get married and like have a family and have a life and and move on and go into my go into my profession and be be treated in a very serious manner 
and be taken seriously. And, and I, want, I want to do a lot of good stuff. I want to be professional. I do everything I can. I can't. Do. The thing is, is, I can't be. I can't be associated with this stuff. I can't be associated with getting wasted and playing fucking the most asinine, immature games over in the hammock and saying, I mean, well, I don't even know what you guys are talking about over there and I don't want to know because I don't want to get upset about it. What are you talking about? We weren't talking about anything bad. I don't, we fought so hard through this past year because of how you were viewed on, on Big Brother and all the stuff that you went through because of it. I, you have an opportunity now to be treated, to be viewed differently, to be viewed like a much more mature person. That doesn't happen when you're drunk and being like... Okay, I'm not drunk and I don't feel like I did anything wrong. Will you please explain to me what I did wrong? You going downstairs? I guess. Okay, cool. You obviously don't want me to be up here. Fine, Brenda, I'm not going to go downstairs. You're stupid. Why are you... What are you doing over there? Nothing. You, you're going you're gonna to sleep on the couch? You're going to let everybody who's watching this see that you're... you Rather than just suck up your pride and, and say that... Maybe yeah, you shouldn't get so drunk. I'm not drunk. Yeah, yeah, it's several hours later, and yeah, you're coming down. But, Rachel, you were very, very drunk. And let me tell you, Portia is fucking ridiculously obnoxious, and you're right there with her. I like Portia. That may be fine, but she's, she's rude, she's inconsiderate. And she's extremely obnoxious. And when you're drinking, you you two are acting right. You guys are acting very similar. And it's embarrassing for me because I, I don't think of you like that. I think you're much different. Sorry for embarrassing you. It's, I, I want you to be the mother of my children. I want you to, I want you to be married to me. I want, I want to have a, a life with you. And I mean... It's like, have fun, like, have some wine, have, have, have a beer. But just don't get to the point where you're being obnoxious because you're so drunk. What did I do that was obnoxious? You don't understand it because you don't, you can't see yourself because you are in this drunken state. What did I do? Just your behavior. Just your behavior, Rachel. Like, it's one thing to have fun. It's another thing to be obnoxious. I'm seeing everybody fucking roll their eyes when you guys are walking around and, and saying stuff to people. And what if, what, first of all, you're what if, hiding beers. I mean, are you kidding me? I didn't hide a single beer, Brendan. Okay, Portia did. I'm sorry. You didn't know she was doing that? No, I didn't. You didn't need to drink any more alcohol. You know that. You knew that you were drunk of a half a bottle of wine. Are you kidding me? I just... I don't know. It may, it may, I don't want to drink anymore. I, I really almost don't want to even be in this house drinking alcohol anymore. Because it's like... I don't... If, if this is... If this is the way things are going to be, I don't want this... I don't want it in my life. What did I do? I don't want you being drunk to where you are, aren't aware of how you're treating others and how you're treating me. I don't treat anyone... Badly, and I didn't do anything wrong, Brendan. Baby, will you just... 
I'm t telling you, I'm telling you, this is for me. You, people are viewing you very poorly. When Why? You're, what did I do that people are viewing poorly? Because all of these people are watching you. And all of these people... We're going to come out of this house and all these people are going to view you the same way they did last time. I just, I from this point forward, I don't, I don't, I'm, I'm done drinking for the rest of the summer. I'm not drinking alcohol. If you want to drink alcohol, you can. No, what that means is you're not allowed to drink alcohol either. I need to say it. Fine, I won't. Well, it's, it worries me. I'm just, I, I, I'm not. When you drink, you, you are a different person. What did I do that was different? You were just, you're inconsiderate. You're what not respectful. You're not respectful of what me. What did I do that was inconsiderate? It's just the way you are behaving. Like how? We just had a talk a couple days ago about you not embarrassing me and demasculinating me in front of other people. You yelling across the yard, Buki and blah blah blah, Snookums and blah. And... Come on, seriously? Do you think that makes me? Do you think that even makes it me feel remotely special about the endearing term or terms that we have for one another? Maybe they think. Maybe they think it's a. Maybe they think it's. It just. It makes me feel like. When that stuff is kind of going on, it's like it's a joke to you. Like, I'm a joke to you. Because I tell you, those people sitting in the hammock, they think your our relationship's a joke when you're doing that. Yeah, okay, Brendan. Who thinks that, Danielle? Uh, fucking Dominic and Keith and Portia and... We just had this talk. We just had this talk, what, two days ago? I can't not call you. I call you Buki at home and you never get mad at me. You're not screaming across the yard. You're not screaming in the backyard in front of everybody. Making me look stupid. I, I told you how this made me feel. Yet you still insist on, on not even, be, not, not even being considered enough not to do it after we just had this conversation. I mean, seriously, to the point where I don't even know if I want to be here anymore. I don't know if I want to stay here. I'm not... I, I did all... I, I came here for you. I wanted to win half a million dollars, yeah, but n not really. I came here because of you, because I, don't, I didn't want you to be here by yourself. Because this entire past year for us was a struggle, a huge struggle. And I didn't think that even coming back into this house was that good of an idea. Because I didn't think it was worth risking our relationship. You wanted to. Because you, we need money. Or you need money. So you thought it was worth, worth doing it. So here's our relationship. Here's me. Telling you that. I don't like this. I like having fun. I like having a glass of wine together. But I don't like you getting drunk. I don't like your behavior. I'm, I'm, it's time for me to grow up. And I would kind of hope that you would grow up with me. And that's what I want.